Lizzo Camp calls out those who make accusations opportunists and calls them fabricated sob story. Lizzo's legal team has been going on the offensive with new legal filings this weekend. Although the singer and her lawyers have already called the allegations against her ridiculous and sensationalized, the tone of the conversation between Lizzo's camp and the former employees suing her for creating an unsafe working environment has never been particularly civil. Lizzo lawyer Martin D. filed a move this week to have the lawsuit dismissed. Singer didn't hold back while referring to the three dancers who filed the case as opportunists and with an axe to grind, as reported by Billboard. He also called their allegations against their former employer fabricated sob story. The three dancers in question made their accusations public in August when they filed a lawsuit against Lizzo and her crew, which included dance captain Shirlene Quigley. They claim that Lizzo and her team had created a hostile work environment by fat shaming the dancers and pressuring them to touch performers at a strip club in Amsterdam. Among other things, the dismissal statement accuses the women, two of whom were fired from Lizzo's employment prior to the lawsuit, of a pattern of gross misconduct and failure to perform their job up to par in an attempt to have the lawsuit dismissed based on the anti-SLAPP statute designed to target meritless lawsuits. Plaintiffs filed this lawsuit against defendants out of resentment, seeking media attention, public sympathy, and a quick reward with little work on their part, instead of accepting responsibility for their own crimes. Along with the letter, Lizzo's legal team submitted written declarations from 18 of her employees, each of whom refuted the accusations in a different way. Other dancers said that Lizzo had always defended their body types or refuted claims that Quigley had harassed staff members because of their religious beliefs.